All right, welcome back everybody to some more Silent Hill 2. It is your favorite vampire, Avalainier. Now, last time we managed to get into Pete's Bolorama. We also managed to pick up the steel pipe. And made sure Maria was okay with hopefully uh, not damaging her too much. And again, she looks fine. Looks fine to me. But anywho, we have now, we have apparently chased Laura to um, Brookhaven Hospital. And that is where we left off. Yeah. Maria. The potential for this illness exists in all people and, under the right circumstances, any man or woman would be driven like him to the other side. The other side perhaps may not be the best way to phrase it. After all, there is no wall between here and there. It lies on the borders where reality and unreality intersect. It is a place both close and distant. Some say it isn't even an illness. I cannot agree with them. I am a doctor, not a philosopher or even a psychiatrist. But sometimes I have to ask myself this question. It's true that to us his imaginings are nothing but the inventions of a busy mind, but to him there simply is no other reality. Furthermore, he is happy there. So why, I ask myself, why in the name of healing him must we drag him painfully into the world of our own reality? I got the key from Joseph. It's probably the key in to that box. And now we got the purple bull key. Still find it funny how she just popped up out of nowhere. Alright. We'll do a little saves coming. Because I know I'm gonna have to go out there to explore the rest of the hospital, but I'm honestly and truly not looking forward to it. And though, so far... I haven't had any problems. We are down to 20 bullets, so I'm gonna have to swap over to the pipe for a little bit. Though, I did want to go ahead and save, like, just in case. Alright. We are now in Brookhaven Hospital. And, once again, there's a crap ton of doors that we can't open. I don't like this. There's the elevators here. That's locked. I had a bad feeling about this. Come on, Maria, let's go this way. Let's actually head back this way. Look, I know I'm being a chicken and everything, but like, you yeah, know. Never be too careful. Plus the fact that, like... That's locked. So... Alright. So it was in the reception room that we found the, um... So if we have the examination room, the doctor's lounge, the pharmacy's locked, storeroom's locked, visiting room's locked. Oh, so those were the bathrooms. We have the cafeteria, the day room, examining room two. Then you have the basement floor. As I said, I am kind of not looking bored. Okay, where 
am I going? Okay, phew. Phew. Alright. So these are the bathrooms. We're not gonna go into the bathroom. No cafeteria. Okay. I'm gonna have to get turned around because I don't like the fact that I can't see anything. Anything in the vent? Nope. Maria, get out of my way, please. That's the elevator, okay. Cool. There's technically two hallways that we could go down. God, oh, this place is so spooky. This place is so spooky. I honestly expect to, like, have a nurse or something pop up. Oh, joy, it's blocked off. This end's blocked off to the garden. As well as the room to the day room. So, it looks like we gotta go around. There's a gurney. Broken. Okay. Why is there airy breathing sounds? Can't get the door open. Door's locked. Only place that we can go is up the stairs. Okay. Okay. It's totally not like anything. Stairs, right? Right. That's the second floor. Do we... Ah! Now the second floor map. And can we go to the third floor? That's a question. I'm honestly curious. This is the third floor. The other roof. Are we able to get up to the roof, I wonder? Or am I gonna have a nasty surprise? Dead end. Uh, why is the silence so eerie?
Okay. So, I mean, the only... The only logical thing... Would be, since we explored one to the extent... Try to explore two to whatever extent we've got. Definitely not looking forward to this. Definitely not going to be looking forward to this. I don't know. I figure I'll just take my chances. And if anything, I could just dash back into the stairwell. Oh, shit. I did not mean to go forward. Ow. You've got to be kidding me. I am run. How can we go? Back in we go. Back in we go. Okay. Well. This. Is going to be a bit short. I head in to try to take on the nurses, and what happens? I get popped. Not once, but twice. <sighs> Sorry for the short video. It's all I got time for for right now. I will definitely be posting something a little longer next week. Sorry to disappoint everybody. It isn't that I'm scared of this game. I'm really not. Silent Hill was my... Literally my introduction to the darkness that is psychological horror. But. Yeah, given the fact that I just literally wasted a crap ton of bullets on a couple of nurses. <laughs> yeah. But. If you like, definitely leave a like and subscribe, and I will catch y'all later. So, later. Bye! Mwah!